Hello, beautiful souls. Have you ever wondered if you can move objects with just your mind? Today, we're diving deep into the fascinating world of telekinesis and spiritualism. Buckle up, because this journey is going to be mind-bending. First, let's talk about what telekinesis is. Telekinesis, also known as psychokinesis, is the supposed ability to move or manipulate objects with the power of the mind alone. Sounds like something straight out of a sci-fi movie, right? But believe it or not, people have been fascinated by this concept for centuries. The history of telekinesis is rich and varied. Ancient texts and cultures have references to mind over matter abilities. From yogis in India to shamans in indigenous tribes, the idea of influencing the physical world with mental power has been around for a long time. In the 19th and 20th centuries, telekinesis gained popularity through spiritualist movements. Mediums claimed to move objects in seances, convincing many that the spirit world could interact with the living. Though skeptics often debunked these claims as trickery, the allure of telekinesis never truly faded. So, how does telekinesis supposedly work? The belief is that our minds can harness a form of energy or life force that can influence physical objects. This energy is often called chi, prana, or simply psychic energy. Practitioners believe that with intense concentration, visualization, and a strong connection to this energy, telekinesis is possible. But can anyone really do it? Well, the scientific community remains highly skeptical. Despite numerous experiments and studies, there has been no conclusive evidence to prove telekinesis exists. Most scientists attribute reported incidents to illusions, wishful thinking, or outright hoaxes. However, for spiritual seekers, the lack of scientific endorsement doesn't necessarily negate the experience. Many people who practice telekinesis claim to have personal experiences that science can't explain. They report that through meditation, mindfulness and energy work, they've achieved small, seemingly impossible feats. Now, this brings us to the intersection of telekinesis and spiritualism. For many, telekinesis isn't just about moving objects, but about expanding their consciousness and understanding the universe's deeper mysteries. It's seen as a pathway to spiritual awakening, a way to connect with the unseen realms. Whether you believe in telekinesis or not, it's undeniable that the practice encourages a deeper connection with one's mind and spirit. It challenges us to explore the potential of human consciousness and our place in the cosmos. So, can you really move objects with your mind? The answer might not be as clear-cut as we'd like. What we do know is that the journey of exploring telekinesis can lead to profound personal growth and spiritual insight. Remember, the universe is full of wonders waiting to be discovered. Notable figures like Yuri Geller brought telekinesis into the public eye with their demonstrations, though many were later debunked. J.B. Rhine, a pioneer in parapsychology, conducted extensive research on telekinesis, though his findings remain controversial. Today, modern-day practitioners continue to explore telekinesis through workshops and online communities. Psychologists suggest that belief systems and the placebo effect play significant roles in perceived telekinetic experiences. Culturally, telekinesis has been a popular theme in movies and literature, influencing public perception and interest. People from various backgrounds share personal stories of telekinesis, adding to the rich tapestry of this phenomenon. Advances in technology allow scientists to study brainwaves and their potential influence on physical objects, though results are still inconclusive. Believing in telekinesis can have profound psychological impacts, 
fostering a sense of empowerment and expanded consciousness. In some cultures, telekinetic elements are incorporated into rituals, blending spiritual beliefs with the quest for mental mastery. Modern-day practices often involve group exercises, meditation, and energy work to cultivate telekinetic abilities. The journey of exploring telekinesis is as much about self-discovery as it is about moving objects. From ancient traditions to modern practices, telekinesis continues to captivate and inspire those who seek to unlock the mysteries of the mind. Whether you view it as a spiritual practice or a psychological phenomenon, telekinesis invites us to explore the depths of our potential. Sharing experiences and learning from others can enrich our understanding and deepen our connection to this intriguing practice. Documenting your journey can provide insights and track your progress as you delve into the world of telekinesis. Ultimately, telekinesis serves as a bridge between the mind, body and spirit, encouraging holistic growth and exploration. The sense of accomplishment and wonder that comes from exploring telekinesis can be a rewarding part of your spiritual journey. Celebrating achievements, no matter how small, fosters a sense of community and shared purpose. As we continue to explore the mysteries of telekinesis, we open ourselves to the infinite possibilities of the universe. Together, we can unlock the secrets of the mind and spirit one step at a time. Thank you for joining me on this expanded journey into telekinesis and spiritualism. Remember, the universe is full of wonders waiting to be discovered. Stay curious, stay open, and never stop exploring. Until next time, kindly stay with us and suggest the best topics. If you have any kind of suggestion, must share with us. We will make a sparkling video on that topic. Thanks for your continued support. Meet you next video. Kindly take care and stay blessed.